I don't try to get political. I don't try to get into people's beliefs. I don't care if you're a Democrat, Republican, conservative, liberal, freaking socialist, communist, whatever. When it comes to the laws uh, for truck drivers and these stupid, dumb laws that can lead a driver into jail with a thousand dollar fine while also banning them from traveling in this free state, this free country. Let's talk about it. So, what is going on everybody? Big Trucker B here. I apologize, I haven't posted a video in well, like four or five days. I have, I have been with pneumonia, I still have pneumonia. If you guys hear my breathing, I can't really um, talk right now. But I seen this, I was reading the news, and I seen this story, and like I said, I don't try to get involved, I don't want to bring politics into my channel. But three Democrat lawmakers have decided to try to propose a bill to ban semi-trucks from traveling on any highway in the state of Georgia. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. What? They can't do that? Well, apparently these Democratic lawmakers say, oh yes we can. They have proposed a bill to make it to where semi-truck drivers cannot go through the state of Georgia unless they are delivering or receiving uh, whether it be people, uh, food, uh, flat, you know, any, any type of commodity. Um, it kind of grinds my gears a little bit. This is the type of shit that, that annoys me. And you want to know what happens if you end up getting caught going through the state of Georgia in a semi-truck. If this bill does pass, $1,000 fine, a misdemeanor, and or one year jail time. As if our prison system this day, these days isn't all fucked up already. As if they're not already overcrowded. Now these three democratic lawmakers want to fill them up more with a stupid law that, that bans the travel of semi-trucks going through a state? This is a free country. We're allowed to go through any freaking state we want to, people. Plain and simple. I don't care how annoyed you are with how big we are or how slow we are. That's also you, Democrats. And I'm sorry, guys. If you're Democrat, listen, I'm not against you. What I'm saying, I'm not, I'm not, listen, I, I, I judge people by their, their person. I'm not attacking you in general. I just want to put that out there for anybody on my, my YouTube. I don't care. I'm independent. I swing both ways when it comes to uh, Democrats or Republicans. But I'm, I'm speaking to the lawmakers. I'm speaking to the, the governors, the whoever. This is some BS. How are you going to justify not allowing trucks to come into a state? What if the guys live there? What if, you know, what if there's trucking companies there? And they don't pick up in Georgia. Maybe they're on the state line. They pick up another state. Uh, another state. You cannot do this. Period. So this bill, uh, known as SB 23, was introduced Wednesday, January 16th, by state senators uh, Donzella James, Harold Jones, and Michael Rett. SB 23 would ban all trucks from using Georgia highways unless they were actively dropping off or picking up people or goods. <laughs> oh, the little, the, the just the little things, right? So I talked to one of my friends on the phone, and he was like, good, good, you know, oh, fuck Georgia. <laughs> you don't need to go through there. That's the way I see it. You know what? Fuck Georgia. But, I'm good. So what? The traffic there sucks around Jacksonville and Atlanta anyway, so who the hell cares? This is the type of stuff that really just, just kind of makes you want to just, just, scream, you know, um, pull the, pull your hair out of your head, because these three people, these three lawmakers, they must have something against drivers. I mean, what else are we supposed to do? If we're not delivering in Georgia, are they expecting us to go just completely around, off route? This is the part where I hope the ATA, the OIDA, 
and other drivers come together and say, nah, we're going to vote against this. We're, we're, we're not going to do this. And I hope that the money goes to fight against this dumb, dumb bill, this law. Can you imagine being a new driver, following your GPS, and it's having you go to Florida? And you're going to uh, Georgia, and then they uh, they pull you over or whatever, check your bill of ladings, and then throw your ass in jail because you followed the GPS through Georgia instead of going all the way around. <laughs> oh, it's not gonna pass. This this won't pass. This is not gonna work out. Listen. Georgia is a decent state until you get to Atlanta. Atlanta's hell when it comes to traffic. Jacksonville, it's bad, but it's not like hell. Um, I've, I've always talked shit about California, but I think Georgia today with those lawmakers putting in this SB 23 bill definitely one upped uh, every, just definitely one upped it. Lee, just proved their their uh, alliance in in loyalty to truck driver. So and then it goes on to saying, when it might seem that truck ban could be tough to enforce, the section of the Georgia code that the bill seeks to amend has a provision that allows for a warrantless get this warrantless inspection for any vehicle that is suspected to be involved and to be in violation of the article. Any vehicle suspected of being operated in violation of this article may be subjected of any ins an inspection conducted by any law enforcement officer who has reason to believe such violation is occurring without the necessity of attaining a warrant to permit such inspection. Um. And poor uh, CDL Life did try to reach out uh, to for comment on the bill, and then once they get uh, an update, then they will post more about it on CDLLife.com. I'll post the link down in the description. Georgia legislative calendar has not yet been set, and for now the bill remains in Senate Hopper. So I will also le uh, list a link in the description for the bill so you can read it yourself. So how about that? How about that, drivers? We are free Americans doing a job for the people, and here we are getting prosecuted, fined, and jailed. God bless the trucker nation, right, guys? God bless everybody. When freedom is not so free, <sighs> kind of makes me dead inside. It just hurts. It really does. But what can you do? Anyway, that's all I want to talk to you guys about, about the trucker news for the day. <laughs> um, I don't know. I want to hear you guys' comments down below. Let's talk about this. And let's, uh, let's just... Just mind blown. I want to see, what, what do you guys think? Do you think we should be prosecuted, you know, jailed, fined, you know, have a misdemeanor on our record for driving through a state, a free state, a free highway that we pay taxes for, that we put, that, that, it's our taxes, it's our money, it's our highways. It just won't work. I, I hope, I hope somebody fights this, because this is just straight up BS. So y'all be safe, and as usual, Big Trucker B out.